cannot believe you would just do this. There is a condition. I knew it. Keep an eye on the politics of the city. I want you to report back to Maria at Rosa in Fiore about targets who are helping the Borgia. And what? You'll make them disappear? The pezzo di merda may hate me, but he's still family. Va bene, we go. I will follow you to the banker. It seems you are ready to die like a gentleman. I have the money. Oh, that's different then. The banker will be pleased. You came alone? Do you see anyone else here? Follow me, Furbacchione. Have you heard anything about my brother Francesco? Cesare is dealing with him. I hope he's all right. So, what are you going to do with my money? The banker likes to treat his friends well. How generous he is. What did you say? Nothing.
Egidio brought the money. Well, well. The banker has a special evening plan. I will be delivering your payment. Give it here. Hold him until I get back. I better not lose sight of the money. Why not release me? I have counted. He's counting the money. Until it is counted, you cannot leave. What is taking him so long? Everything going well in there? We have to go, Luigi, or we'll be late. The count is complete. Va bene. Kill him. No. Lucky you. Luigi says he gets to live. Lead the way, boss. making good time. We're on track. Soon we will be there. Now we are making good time. The route you are taking is very interesting. I would not have gone this way, but who am I? It is so nice to explore the city. Ideally, we would be going the other way. I am not complaining. He's going in the wrong direction. Uh, where are we going? Now we are making good time. We're on track. I hope they let us go inside. Signor, are you all right? 
It is so nice to explore the city. Uh, where are we going? Now we are making good time. The route you are taking is very interesting. I hope they let us go inside. I know, the city is pretty confused. We are sure this job will be over. Soon we will be there. Now we're going the right way. I hope they let us go inside. When was the last time you were going to We have a few moments to live. The route you are taking is very interesting. I would not have gone this way, but whoever. We are on track. Now we are making good time. We are nearly there. Soon this job will be over. Do you think he's forgotten? Now we're going. Isn't the banker the other one? Now we are making good time. Now we're... I am not questioning your authority, but should we not get going? The route you are taking is very interesting. I would not have gone. He's going in the wrong direction. Isn't the banker the other way? I know, the city is pretty conf... Signor, are you all right? We're on track. The route you are taking is very interesting. I would not have gone this way, but now we're going the right way. I hope they let us go inside. Now we are making good time. We are nearly there. Yeah, soon the party will be all around us. Hand me the chest, Luigi. I will bring it to the banker. You may enter. We can't go in. You have to patrol by order of Cesare. Por Capitana. Cesare is here. Luigi has been killed. We discovered his body at the Pantheon. Luigi? We just let him in. Claudia, that the banker is here. Tell Claudia that the banker is here. If I was 
Money for you, banker. I will take that. And that. You are dismissed. Where did I put my coin purse? Honoratissima. Welcome to my party. I am Juan Borgia. Cesare is about to speak in the main room, Eccellenza. Come. I owe you all the twins. Not mine. On the contrary. Hang on. I watched you steal my guard money. I believe I've earned a free ride as repentance. In fact, I want you here all night long. Thank you all for coming. We have a long night ahead of us. Yes, actually, I am. There is so much to look at. Oh, good. Stay here. I've spared no expense. I can tell you. The finer things in life that make power so worthy. I see an apple. I can pluck that apple. No one can stop me. Well, it depends who's doing this. 
You don't seem to understand. I own all the truth. Not mine. On the contrary, I watched you steal my guard's money. I believe I've earned a free ride as repentance. In fact, I want you here. What better way to celebrate my victories than to join in the brotherhood of man? Soon, we will be here once more celebrating a united Italia. And then the feasting will last for 40 days and 40 nights. Cominciamo ora! We did not agree to conquer Italia. If your brilliant Captain General says we can do it, why not rejoice and let it happen? You risk upsetting the delicate balance of control we have worked so hard to tighten. I appreciate all that you have done for me, but I have the army, so I am making the decisions. Don't look so good. Enjoy yourself.
something with danger or something. Taking an energizing concoction of Arab scrumpy. Caramel sanitary. of delicacies. But I gave the people what they wanted. And now you pay for it. Il piacere immeritato si consuma da se. Reguiescat in pace. Where are Claudia and Maria? We came back with the money. They followed us home. <laughs> What? My sister knows how to wield a knife. And I am ready to do it again. Spoken like a true auditore. Finally, you two came to your senses. It's about time. Ay, you 
want some honey. Get the invite. to you too. Ezio! I was expecting my wife. Somehow that does not surprise me. The French putane have us under pressure. Tell me about their general, this Baron de Valois. Cesare persuaded King Louis to lend him an entire army to defeat me. I'm flattered. Where can I find him? It's only a matter of time before I have Valois by the throat. We have them in retreat. They seem to be getting closer. The situation is under control. Close the gates! Benny, so maybe I could use a little help. Oh. Ezio, oh. shut the gate! Oh, the other end! 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 Oh,
The Baron de Valois signals from the field. Bonjour, General Dalbiano. Êtes-vous prêt à vous rendre? Why don't you come closer and say that? You must learn how to speak French. It would mask your barbaric sensibilities. Perhaps you could teach me, and I would instruct you in fighting, since you seem to do so little of it. As amusing as this parley has been, I'd like your unconditional surrender before sunrise. Ha! My Lady Bianca will whisper it in your ear. I believe another lady might object to that. Mio marito vi ammazzerà tutti. I'll kill you for tutto francese! Calm down for your wife's sake. You know my terms. Enter my camp unarmed at dawn. And practice your French. Soon all of Italy will be speaking it. I'll get you pezzo di merda, figlio di puttana! between your thighs. In fact, there is a hole there, so deep it reaches into the maledetto inferno! What good are you two are dead? We will regroup and fight through the gates as we did at the Arsenale. The entrance is thicker with Frenchmen than the streets of Paris. So we will climb the battlements. They cannot be scaled. Pantasilea would know what to do. Maybe this is the end. I enter at dawn bearing gifts. And hope that coward spares her life. Perché non ci ho pensato prima? What did I say? Call your men back to the barracks. I will explain there. You better have something good. Fall back! Once inside, your men can overpower the camp's patrols, correct? Yes, but... Especially if the patrols are taken completely by surprise. Ma certo. Then we need to liberate several suits of French armor. At dawn, we are going to walk right in. Ah! Ezio Auditore! You are truly a man after my own heart. <laughs> Magnifico! I will get the armor. My troops will gather it from the dead. We will then depart from the north so as not to arouse suspicion. And Ezio, make sure to kill them without a fight. 
The armor has to stay clean.
Bring me a suit of that perverted armor. You are not wearing one. What? It is part of the plan. You surrender to us, we are bringing you to the Baron. Ah, yes. Then what? Your men attack on my signal. Benny, go change into costume. Don approaches. Get into formation! We must follow the patrol. We cannot deal yet or the Duke's men will know something is wrong. The Baron thinks Cesare will allow the French to rule Italy. He's so blinded by the trickle of royalty in his blood that lazy inbred can't see the battlefield. Whatever the fact. I wish the crown would open up and 
Cesare and the Baron seem to have a different style. There will come a day in which men no longer cheer each other. And on that day, you will see the eyes really capable I have heard that before. It is something your father once wrote. Please, God, just let me live! I will take care of them. I wish the crown would open up and suck all the fortune bugs down to hell. Please, be civil. No need to be shy. Come forward. Mercy on this poor soul. Stop them before they attack us. No business here. Leave. Que venez-vous faire ici? Mes soldats, rejoignez le capitaine italien à son excellence, le baron. Il vous surround. What part of France are you from? Montréal! Open the gate! You speak French? There were a couple of French girls in Firenze. General Dalviano, it seems that you have seen the light. Enough of your crap! Release my wife! Such entitlement from a man born with nothing to his name. Mine is worth its currency, unlike yours, which is counterfeit. How dare you? You think that commanding an army grants you nobility? Nobility comes from fighting beside your soldiers, not kidnapping a woman to cheat your way out of battle. 
Why don't you grow up here and release my wife? You savages never learn. Where do you think you're going? <laughs> they send Bambini to do a man's work. <laughs> Ezio, you have to save my wife! Take the rooftops! I only wanted respect. Respect is earned. 
not inherited or purchased. Perhaps you are right. I need more time. Che tu sia pari nella morte, la guiesca ti pace. Fantasilea! Don't ever disappear again. I was lost without you. Really? But you rescued me. Ezio came up with a brilliant plan. I did not. It was all your husband's idea. It was? You are my prince. Now I better earn that title. You will. Thank you. Arrivederci, messere. Come yourself. your mind? It's gone from you, kid. Such a fine assassin would no doubt relieve Buongiorno, Ezio. 
It is time to pay a visit to Lucrezia's lover, Pietro. I've sent my men out to find him. Molto bene. Ezio, if I may. What is it? Someone warned Rodrigo to stay away from the castello. Machiavelli? Do you have proof? No. We must not be split apart by mere suspicion. The Borgia know the locations of our spies. Who told them? Maestro Machiavelli asked about our search for Pietro earlier today. Ezio? I still do not believe Machiavelli has turned traitor. First the villa attack, then the castello, and now this. He is behind it all. What were you able to find out? Pietro is to be assassinated this evening. Cesare sent his butcher. Micheletto, the best killer in Roma. No one escapes him. Until tonight. Come on.
Did you uncover information about Pietro? The man is an actor, and he is performing in a play stanotte. Find out about Pietro. He is to be suspended from a cross. Micheletto will come for him with a spear. Where is Pietro? I cannot tell you. But Micheletto waits at the city gate east of the Terme di Traiano. He intends to disguise his men to make the killing look like an accident. He will lead me to Lucrezia's lover. Ezio, Machiavelli has betrayed us. We would both wish to deny it, but the truth is now clear. Do what needs to be done. If you don't, I will. Without Volpe's thieves, I may require the help of my recruits.
please. I have done nothing. Francesco Trocchi. Dear friend, would I lie to you? You told your brother about my war plans in Romagna, who contacted the ambassador of Venezia. It was an accident. I am still your servant and ally. Are you demanding that I discount your actions and rely on friendship? I am asking, not demanding. To unite Italia, I must have every institution under my control. And if the church does not fall in line, I will eliminate it entirely. You know that I really work for you, not the Pope. Ah, but do I, Troche? There's only one way I can know that unconditionally now. You intend to kill me? Your most loyal friend? Of course not. Are you letting me go? Thank you, Cesare. You will not regret... <coughs> Guards! Give Micheletto the costumes for the play. Lucrezia is mine. No one else shall have her. Make doubly sure it is done correctly. I obey, Cesare. Oh, yes. Dumb Francesco's body in the Tevere. Once you get dressed, you follow me to the play. Capito. Tieni.
Which way did he go? You want a dead man? Oh. Once you get dressed, you follow me to the play. Capito. This is for you. Once you get dressed, you follow me to the play. Capito. Il tuo costume. Oh, 
You there! That could be... Where do I think I know that word? <coughs> Colosseo. I seek Pietro. He acts on stage, Signore. One of my men will take you to him. Don't forget, I wear the black shirt. Protect me and wait for Pilot's call to the Centurion to strike. I must get to Pietro before he does. Forsaken me! Merda. Which cross is Pietro's? Hark! Hark how he crieth upon Elijah to deliver him! Wait and we shall see whether Elijah dare come here or not. My thirst is great. My thirst is great. Yes, thou shalt drink no more!
that I here see dead, hanging, that never yet did a miss. For surely God's son is he. Therefore a tomb is made for me, therein his body buried shall be. For he is king of bliss. Sir Joseph, I say surely, this is God's son almighty. Go ask Pilate for him. that is dead today. Thou grant me his body. Joseph, already in good faith, if that centurion says that he... Ha! 
You cannot save Pietro. The wine he drank was poisoned. As I promised Cesare, I made doubly sure. I am not yet dead. I did not come here to kill you. He who is the cause of someone else becoming powerful is the agent of his own destruction. Cut him down. This was not in rehearsal. Hold up the guards. Stop the guards! you your savior get now i said it. mercy what have i done <laughs> He's been poisoned. But Paolo, Cantarella, drink this. Hurry! Give him a moment. I feel slightly better. Leeches will lead to a full recovery. I cannot thank you enough. I... The key to the Castel Sant'Angelo, now. What are you talking about? I'm simply a poor actor. Cesare knows about you and Lucrezia. Here. Stop! Wait for us! We thought you had been killed, Sir Ezio. Not yet. Where does this passage lead? To the north, outside the walls. Let me through. I must go help the troops. Un momento. You were at the Villa Auditore during the attack. the traitor, not Machiavelli. Long live the Borgia! Merda. I was right. I have to stop La Volpe before he gets to Machiavelli. Keep it up and I'll have it on.
crazy. I have discovered the traitor. What? One of our men. He was at the villa attack. Here, he carried his letter. My God. This is good news. More than you know. I am once again in your debt, Ezio. What debt is there amongst friends who trust one another? Yes. Thank you for relaying the message in time. Come, Niccolò. It has been far too long since we've talked. I heard the Colosseum Passion Play took an unexpected turn this evening. Really? It seems Jesu Cristo was resurrected three days early. What exactly? Prompted that outpouring of impertinence. Basta! If you seek fair. friends about me Volpe, how goes Roma? Very well, Ezio. The French and Papal forces are in disarray. Then it is almost time. Call the assassins together. And bring Claudia. Now? Yes. La Ashaya Wakon Mutlak, Bel Kulun Mumkin. The wisdom of our creed is revealed through these words. We work in the dark, to serve the light. We are assassins. Claudia, we here dedicate our lives to protecting the freedom of humanity. Mario, our father, and our brother once stood around this fire, fighting off the darkness. Now, I offer the choice to you. Join us. You and I have not seen eye to eye on many issues. Niccolò! But you are exactly what the Order needed. You have led the charge against the Templars and rebuilt this Brotherhood. Now we must put Ezio where he belongs. At the head of the Assassins. Ezio Auditore da Firenze. You will now be known as Il Mentore, the guardian of our Order and our secrets. Where other men blindly follow the truth, remember, nothing, nothing is, is true. true. Where other men are limited by morality and law, remember, everything, everything is permitted. Why this sudden change of heart? I have always stood by you. I was the one who brought you to Roma, and the one who caused the explosion as you fled the castello. The mercenari who protected you at Il Colosseo were mine as well. You just did not know it. Maestro Machiavelli, Cesare has returned to Roma alone. He arrives for the Castel Sant'Angelo. Grazie. Well? 
The decision is yours, not mine. Niccolo, you better not stop telling me what you think. Why else would I seek the opinion of my most trusted advisor? Go kill them, Mentore. Finish what you started. Good advice. I intend to write a book about you one day. If you do, make it short.
I want to see the Pope. His Holiness waits for you at the top of the castell in his apartments. Get out of my way! I don't understand. I ordered a fresh batch of La Cantarella last night. I am terribly sorry, Mia Signora, but the Pope has taken it all. Where is the Pope? He meets with Cesare. Strange. He did not tell me Cesare had returned. That woman gives me so much trouble. Why didn't I stay in the stables? What a family this Pope has.
What has happened here? I do not know what you mean. My funds, my troops, gone! Financial difficulties strike all of us, even those with an army. You intend to give me money? No, I do not. Then I will use the peace of Eden to get what I want. Your help is not necessary. That has been made abundantly clear to me. Are you aware that the Baron de Valois is dead? No. Did you? What reason could I possibly have to kill him? Was he plotting against me with my brilliant traitorous Captain General? I do not have to stand for this! The assassins murdered him. Why did you not stop them? As if I could. It was not my decision to attack Monterigione. It was yours! It is high time you took responsibilities for your actions. My accomplishments! Despite the constant interference of failures like you! You are not going anywhere. I have the peace of Eden. Get out of my way, old man. I gave you everything, and yet it's never enough. Cesare! He intends to poison you! You would not listen to reason. Father, do you not see? I control all of this. If I want to live, I live. If I want to take, I take. If I want you to die, you die! <coughs> Where is the piece of Eden? Stop! I know where it is! And you did not tell me he had taken it? Cesare, it's me, your queen. You are my sister, nothing more. Where is it? You never loved me? Where is the apple? Tell me! Je tell me! Cesare, I am coming through that window. I want the apple! <laughs> am I hurting you? Give me the apple! It's mine, not yours! I want the apple! 
Am I hurting you? Give me the apple! It's mine, not yours! I want the apple! <laughs> Smart decision, little sister. Requiescat in pace. I know. <clears throat> I know where that bastard is going. San Pietro. The pavilion in the courtyard. <clears throat> Thank you. Assassino! Cazzo. I will come for you, Fate. Ragazzi! 
Captain Bastard! Now, get him! Thank <laughs> you. 